So guys, what do you want to do today? Oh dude, I found this tattoo gun in my neighbor's trash can. Who wants to get a tattoo? Oh me, 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 I want a tattoo. No, Junior, that tattoo gun looks dirty. It probably has a bunch of diseases on it. <sighs> Fine, Cody. Joseph, can you please get a napkin and wipe off the tip? <sighs> I guess so, dude. That's Hold what on. I said to her. I wiped it off. Are you happy? Yeah, you happy now, Cody? Uh, guys, why don't we just draw tattoos on ourselves with a marker? That's dumb. It's not a tattoo. It's not permanent. Yeah, it's not real, dude. We could use a permanent marker. Uh, no, we gotta, we gotta use a tattoo gun. It has to be a real tattoo, Cody. Yeah, feel the pain. <sighs> okay, I guess I'll get a tattoo. But you will? Oh, okay, well, what kind of tattoo will you get, Cody? Uh, I want a tattoo above my butt that says entrance only. Wait, how are you gonna take a dump? <laughs> Who needs to do that? Okay, uh, take your shirt off. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop moving, dude. You're gonna make me mess up. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, I think I'm done. How's it look, guys? Okay, that looks really cool. Yeah, it looks pretty sick if I do say so myself. Okay, I'll take your word for it because I can't see it. Oh, you should get a tattoo on your chest. What, and cover up these six-pack abs? Yes. I mean, it would look really good. Well, okay, yeah. I think I want straight out of the closet on my chest. Ooh, and then I want a heart on my bicep with Ken's name in it so that every time I flex, it looks like the heart's beating. Okay, that'd be really awesome. All right, coming right up, dude. And done. Straight out of the closet. <laughs> yeah, I am. Man, Cody, your tattoos are so cool, and I love the one with Ken's name in the heart. Yeah, he's gonna like that. You guys think I should get a tattoo on my leg? Oh, yeah, you should definitely get a tattoo on your leg. <laughs> Which one? I have three. We should probably give Junior a tattoo before I run out of ink. Oh, yeah, it's my turn to get a tattoo. It's my turn. What kind of tattoo do you want, Junior? Um, I don't know. Ooh, guys, I hate the Cleveland Browns. I think that football team sucks, so I'll get I hate the Browns on my face. Wait, what did you say? No, Junior, you shouldn't do that. What's wrong with saying I hate the Browns? I think that football team sucks. Their mascot is a pit bull, and their logo is just a helmet. How lazy is that? I get the helmet thing, but maybe you should say Cleveland Browns it's so we can know what you're talking about, Junior. Wait, put I hate Cleveland Browns on my face? Yes, exactly. That's going to take up a lot of space. I think if I put I hate the Browns, people know what I'm talking about. No, Junior, they won't. What if I, what if I hate the White Sox, and I put I hate White Sox all over my my face, huh? Huh? You have to put socks out. No, I don't. No, I don't. Oh, okay. Okay, guys, I think the brown sucks. So right? if I put the brown suck on my face. No, no, Jenny, you shouldn't do that. Uh, I think the browns are smelly, so I put the browns are smelly on my face. Uh, what if I put the whites are privileged on my face, huh? Huh? G guys, I think we should just get away from the browns tattoo. Yeah, oh. yeah, we should. Okay, I'll think of a different tattoo. Hmm. Ooh, guys, I want a tattoo that when girls see it, they want to come talk to me. Ooh, so what if I get come here on my face? And then they'll say, oh, he, he wants me to come here. So I, they walk over and they talk to me. Uh, okay, that's better. Junior, I, I think that sounds like a tattoo I should get. Wait, are you trying to steal all the tattoos, Cody? No, I just don't think that tattoo is going to get the kind of response you think. All right. Mm, I want like a rapper tattoo, like a really cool tattoo. Yeah. Ooh, like, like, ooh, like baller's life on my face. Ooh, I like that. That's yeah, yeah, nice. Yeah, like I'm a big baller. So I put baller's life on my face and, okay. then, and then put two teardrops. Ooh, yeah, yeah. I okay, can do, that. Do, do, do that. And done, dude. Balls are life. Wait, what'd you say? Balls are life, dude. That's what you wanted on your face. I wanted baller's life. Like I'm a big baller. B A L L E R Z. What'd you put? Balls are life. Why would you put balls are life on my face? Why would I want that? Uh, basketball, dude. That's ball is life, not balls are life. This is a dumb tattoo. I'm sorry, dude. Did you do the teardrops? Yeah, yeah, they're on there, dude. Okay. They look like balls. What? No, they don't, dude. Uh, Cody thinks everything looks like balls. So you, okay, Cody, what does it look like? Teardrops or balls? It looks like a ball sack. You put a ball sack on my face? No, I did it, dude. Oh, oh, you know what? Let me do a tattoo for you. I want to do your next tattoo. Are you sure it's going to show up on my brown skin or is it too smelly for you, huh? Guys, huh? guys can we not? Hey, guys, what? doing? Oh, hey, Jeffy. Why well, you have a ball sack on your face, Junior? It is a ball sack, Joseph! No, it's not! Uh, Jeffy, we're getting tattoos. Oh, sweet. I want a tattoo. Oh, what kind of tattoo do you want? I want Daddy Shucks right here on my arm because my daddy won't take me to Chuck E. Cheese today. You sure you don't want the brown suck on your arms? J Joseph, look, I think I should do the tattoo because you might end up making it look like a ball sack. No, I won't, dude. Look, Jeffy, just come here, dude. All right. And done. See, Junior, no balls. You spelled sucks wrong. That's the cool way to spell it. Jeffy, dinner's ready. Oh, that must mean my dad ain't telling me dinner's ready. And if he feeds me green beans tonight, I'm going to say, read the tattoo. Jeffy, get in here. Oh, I'm coming, Daddy. Jeffy, stop that. Eat your green beans. Daddy, you know I hate it when you feed me green beans. So that's why I got this tattoo. You got a tattoo, Jeffy? Jeffy! Well, that's permanent. It's never going to come off. Well, then you'll know you suck forever then, Daddy. Oh, my God, Jeffy. You, you are so grounded for getting that tattoo. Marvin, we need to call a doctor. See if he can get it removed. Well, I don't want it removed. But what I do want removed is this big hump on my back. Jeffy, look, eat your green beans. And we're going to find out what punishment you're going to get. Aww. 
I parked in the handicapped spot even though I'm not handicapped because I don't want to walk far. God forgive me in my bad knees. Hey lady, give me your car keys. Uh, okay, I, I think I left them in the car. That'll be easy for you. Just take them. Okay, uh, and don't follow me. Uh, can you at least pick me up when I'm done shopping? No! Oh, how evil. <laughs> Hey, ma'am, did you call the cops? Yes, yeah, some man just stole my car! Okay, ma'am, just calm down. What did he look like? Uh, he was very scary. Uh, okay, uh, did he have any recognizable features, like any tattoos? Oh, yes, he had a tattoo on his left arm that said, Daddy Sucks, spelled S-U-X. I thought it was very disrespectful to his father. Okay, ma'am, I'm gonna look for that guy right away. All right, Jeffy, you're gonna get rid of that tattoo. I'll get rid of this tattoo when you get rid of that turd on your top lip. It's a mustache, Jeffy. Oh, is that what you're calling it? Marvin, we need to call a doctor to see if he can remove Jeffy's tattoo. Oh, and also tell him I look like the hunchback of Notre Dame. Look, I'm gonna call a doctor to get him to remove your stupid tattoo. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? Sorry I took so long, I had to change out of my cop outfit into my doctor outfit. It's fine, you didn't take too long. Alright, so what's going on? Well, my son got a tattoo and I want you to remove it. Oh, I've been there. I've had plenty of bad tattoos in my life. Like, I got my ex-wife's name, I got my other ex-wife's name, and I got my soon-to-be ex-wife's name. You have a lot of ex-wives. Yeah, they know how to get me, they just don't know how to keep me. Oh, and then this one time, I had a birthmark that looked like a seahorse, so I got it traced in a tattoo, and then it turns out it wasn't a birthmark, it was a rash, and it went away, so now I just have a really badly drawn seahorse on my butt cheek. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. All right, so look, the tattoo my son got is he got Daddy Sucks on his left arm. He had a tattoo on his left arm that said Daddy Sucks, spelled S-U-S. I thought it was very disrespectful to his father. Are you okay? Your son's under arrest. What? I said your son's under arrest! What? Hold on, let me get my cop outfit on. Wait, what's going on? All right, I'm back. And your son's under arrest. For what? For stealing a car. He didn't steal a car. Oh, yeah? Well, I got a call before I came over here from some lady that said somebody stole her car. And she said that guy had a tattoo on his left arm that said, Daddy sucks. Well, but Jeffy didn't steal the car, though. When would he have had time to do that? Yeah, Jeffy's been with us the whole time. He never stole a car. Well, of course you're going to say that. You're his parents. You're going to cover for him. I get it. But, but what if there's a guy with the same exact tattoo as Jeffy? Oh, come on. What are the odds there's two guys with the same Daddy sucks tattoo? That's a possibility. And you know how I know he's guilty? because you called me over here to have the tattoo removed. That means you were trying to get rid of the evidence and you didn't think I'd notice. But I did, because I'm smart and you're dumb. Well, no, 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 we want the tattoo removed because it's a dumb tattoo. We weren't trying to hide any evidence because there is no evidence because he didn't steal a car. Because if he did steal the car, where's the car at then? I don't know, you probably parked it in the woods and then lit it on fire. I don't know how you dumb criminals think because you're dumb. Did I mention how dumb you are? You're so dumb. Well, no, we didn't steal a car. You don't have any evidence to arrest him. Well, that tattoo is evidence enough for me. Come on, Jeffy, we're going downtown. Well, no, do you get her? Oh. We need to call a lawyer. We're going to get a lawyer. Jeffy, we're going to get the best lawyer we can get. Thanks for being my son's lawyer, Goodman. Oh, don't mention it, but I do charge $800 a minute. $800 a minute? We'll start talking! Okay... Talk faster! Well, I was reviewing your son's case, and he's screwed. Screwed? Why? Because the tattoo matches, and that means he's guilty. He's not guilty. Other people have that tattoo, and they haven't found the stolen car. Well, I was comparing your son's case to a previous case, where the cops arrested this kid named Jimmy because he cracked corn, and they didn't care. So that's where the song came from, Jimmy cracked corn, and I don't care. Well, anyway... Anyway, Jimmy got the electric chair and then his parents cared. So then they renamed the song, Jimmy got the electric chair and his parents cared. What does that have to do with my son's case? Oh, it doesn't. But there was also this other case where there once was this farmer who had a dog and the dog's name was Bingo. Well, anyway, the farmer got murdered and then they found blood on the dog and so then they used the dog as evidence and Bingo was his name-o. So, so what are you trying to say? Well, what I'm trying to say is if you can find the stolen car and the guy with the tattoo, that's your Bingo. Okay, so if I find the stolen car and the guy with the tattoo, then my son gets set free, right? Bingo. Okay, I'm gonna go find it. Marvin, what did the lawyer say? He said if we can find the stolen car and the guy with the tattoo, they'll let Jeffy go. I could have told you that. So baby, all we have to do is find the stolen car. If the police can't find the car, how can we? Well, we can just go to Walmart and look in the parking lot and see if there's any cars with the same, that looks the same. I don't know what I'm doing, baby. I'm not a bounty hunter. <gasps> baby, I got an idea. Why don't we go pick up a homeless guy, give the homeless guy the same tattoo Jeffy has, and say the homeless guy stole the car. That's terrible. We can't do that. Sure we can. Look, look, the homeless guy will get three meals a day, a bed to sleep in, and a shower in jail. If the homeless guy wanted all that, I'm sure he would commit a crime and go to jail himself. Well, maybe he hasn't thought of this, baby. Look, we're doing a good thing here. Marvin, that's terrible. No, we can't do that. Baby, please, come on. We'll get Jeffy out of jail, and the homeless guy gets a new place to live. No, I don't want to be a part of this. Well, well I'm going to do it anyway to help Jeffy. Hey, hey, 
Hey. I want to go to school. Hey, hey, hey there, buddy. It's, it's a nice box you got there. My box. Uh, yeah, your box. Um, I notice you're not wearing a shirt. How would you like to wear a nice bright orange shirt? Oh, cool. Yeah, and bright orange pants to match. Oh, these pants are poopy. Okay. Well, you come to my house, I got Rice Krispie Treats. Oh, Snap Crackle Pop. Yeah, Snap, snap Crackle Pops. Come, come to my house. <laughs> All right, buddy, there's your Rice Krispie Treat. Uh, yummy. <laughs> yeah, it's real good. So, so while you eat that, I need to draw something on your hand with this gun. Beer. What? Beer. Well, I'll get you a beer after I do this tattoo thing. Mm -mm. Beer forced. <sighs> okay, I'll, I'll get you a beer. <laughs> All right, there's your beer. Cheers, bald man. Cheers. Okay, so while you drink that, I'm gonna give you a tattoo on your hand. Marvin, what are you doing? I'm doing my plan. No, I told you no. He's okay with it. Did you ask him? <sighs> Can I give you a tattoo on your hand? Aliens at my brain. Don't eat the yogurt. It's alien ectoplasm. See, he knows what he's talking about. That was not a yes. Maybe he's okay with it. No, I'm gonna do what's right. Come on, let's go outside. No, oh, I like it here. No, come on, let's go outside. You stink. Oh, I don't like this lady. This lady's mean. Mean lady. Yeah, exactly. Mean lady. Does he know what you're trying to do? What? Oh, bald man's nice. Bald man give me beer and Rice Krispies. No, bald man's trying to put you in jail. Oh, bald man wouldn't do that, would you, bald man? Give me a hug, bald man. But don't, don't, please don't touch me. Oh, bald man. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, stop, stop. Let me go. Look, please let me go. Please. Ew. Stop it. Okay. Look, look, look. So, so, look. He's he's fine. See, he's happy. He, he likes his beer and his Rice Krispies, and he's gonna be okay with this tattoo. So, Marvin, no. Man, Hold still. Ow. All right. It's done. I can't read. It says, Daddy sucks. And clearly you think that because, I mean, your dad wasn't there for you. Look at your situation. Oh, bad daddy. Yep, bad daddy. Now I'm going to call the cops. You are the worst person I ever met, Marvin. I'm doing this for Jeffy. I'm, I'm being nice. Uh, look, are you ready for some bright orange clothes? Yay. Hey. And a bed? <laughs> and three meals a day? <laughs> Yummy. And maybe TV? Ooh, fancy. Yeah, awesome. So I'm going to go call the... Uh, the, the, the Hello? Hey there, you call the cops? Yes, I found the real guy who stole the car and has the same tattoo as the guy that you think he did it. But really? Yeah, he, he's upstairs. All right. There he is, officer, there he is, and there's his tattoo. Nah, it's not him. What do you mean it's not him? Well, sucks is spelled right. What do you mean sucks is spelled right? Well, in the tattoo I'm looking for, sucks is spelled with an X. Oh, damn it! Ha <laughs> ha! Sorry for wasting your time, sir. Oh, bald man gives me beer and Rice Krispies. Oh, really? Well, bald man never gives me beer and Rice Krispies when I come over. What a good friend. <sighs> bald man, can I have another beer? No, leave! Oh, but what about the clothes and the TV? Yeah, Marvin, what about the clothes and the TV? And the three meals a day. Oh, the three meals a day, Marvin. Yeah, you can't forget about that. Well, go commit a crime and you'll get those things. Oh, who's that? I got it. No, I got it. No, allow me. Hello? Freeze is a burglary! Oh, officer down! Ah! What was that screaming? Give me all your jewelry! Ah, they take whatever you want! And your rice Christmas trees! My rice Christmas! Nobody takes my rice Christmas. You just saved my life! We're here today to thank this homeless man who's, oh, oh, God, your breath stinks. Could you back up a little bit? Thank you. Uh, we're here today to thank this homeless man who helped catch Mr. Mina, the criminal who stole a car and also shot me, and his pants are falling down on live TV. This is very embarrassing for him. I'm, uh, can we get a sensor bar there? Uh, I'm just going to keep going. We're, we're awarding him this key to the city, which will allow him to sleep anywhere he wants on the street in the city. Here you go. What? All right. Oh, okay. See, baby, something good happened to the homeless guy after all. Not because of you. Well, actually, it is because of me. Because if I wouldn't have got him off the streets into our house, he wouldn't have saved the day. You always have to make it about you, don't you? Well, it, the most important thing is we have Jeffy back home. Well, Daddy, we never got this hump looked at. My hump, my hump, my hump, my hump, my huge back hump. <laughs>